I really like abandoned places and this is Safira, uh, an abandoned uh, village in Alentejo. It, I think everyone left at about 1930s and if you look around it's hard to believe anyone would want to leave. It's beautiful. There's a small lake, grass, fields, it's high up so you have like an amazing view. Unbelievable! Why did you people leave this place? So I didn't know where we were coming. Pedro took us, like a surprise My visit. And me. now I'm guessing, My I know. I know. I think he brought me to see my future house. <laughs> to be restored. Fig tree just near the house. Beautiful view, calm and peace and birds and whatever. Good good job, Pedro. <laughs> he, he just woke up. He's just not very in a mood. But he'll be better. Hey, look it. How cool is this? Traveling from the deep forest into the sun. In war, there's never an option. How is it possible? Places like this to I wonder if there are still records uh, how this place used to be 1903 Sofira, I'm just wondering how the people lived here, how they looked like, what the houses looked like. This is such a peaceful landscape. There are no big cities around. Even to get here we, we got lost and it's a very tiny narrow road that comes here and then it just ends here then it's just like a, a dirt road and i don't know i have no idea of the reason why they left such an amazing countryside but it was very nice afternoon walking around and now that it's spring everything is blooming and it's just you and the nature and the birds I don't think you can. I can stop the guy. Cause I love you more than words can say. Yeah, baby, in each and every way. Back in time, this cemetery 
is 134 years old. Unbelievable, just come and take a look. I think I'm too good to fall 